Well, 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 everybody. Welcome back to Power World, where uh, I am starting to feel like we've grown out of this base. We've currently got two bases, as you know, if you've been following along with the series. And this one is really close to the like initial spawn point. Recently, we set out and uh, went on quite a journey across the world onto some just crazy... We just went on a crazy exploration and uncovered some really cool stuff. And I kind of want to like suss out the opportunities of a base out there somewhere the thing is we've hit our maximum i guess base location situation we're gonna have bases out here we've also got our second base which is acting more as like a metal outpost out here uh which by the way i came over to today to see how it's been going and uh it's going good uh we've actually got a lot of metal uh or ingots coming up which is fantastic i'm gonna come and actually collect these uh, we've got 40 currently crafting up. Um, yeah, my dudes here are doing exactly what they need to be doing, uh, except they were kind of starving, so I had to come and feed them. Uh, but long story short, uh, yeah, ingots coming in left, right, and center, which is exactly... It's fulfilling its purpose, which is amazing. <laughs> it's what I need. The problem is, like I said, we can only have two bases, and uh, both of those two base slots are filled up currently. So I don't know if when or if possible it's going to give us a third opportunity um but fingers crossed that it gives us that opportunity very very soon because this current place is going to be tough to work with and i guess i say that because when we come over here and hop inside of our little stone chest uh, we've got like a lot of we've got like 500 stone in here which i'm currently trying to break down into uh uh Padium fragments. You can craft them from. In fact, whoa. My dudes are just like harvesting them and just leaving them lying around like this for reals. And then over here, wood. We've got 2,000 wood. Um, I don't know how to transport this stuff. I don't know if there are pals that are good for that sort of stuff, but um, yeah, that's kind of the predicament that I'm in currently. Where do I put these? Is that why we're not putting our fragments anywhere? Because I just don't have anywhere to put them. I finally gone and displaced a lot of the stuff in my inventory too. We've got this big old chest finally. So that's kind of fulfilling that purpose with a little bit of wooden here for some reason. Um, and I finally got my amazing crossbow that we for some reason couldn't extract yesterday. This thing is amazing. It deals a ton more damage than what our previous one was doing. So uh, that is just absolutely remarkable. I'm actually going to drop my, uh, my club. I think it's about time we get us a spear. So let's uh, let's craft up a spear or at least let someone do that for us. Um, and as far as things go, we've, we've... Oh, that's right. Yeah, we should get a metal helmet going as well. Our armor's busted to pieces. So it's probably in our best interest to go and uh, work on that right this second. Once my... Yeah, my lift monk. I'll let you do that. I've got another egg incubated. So let's go and uh, check that out and see what we can pull out of this. A ray hound. I do not have a Rayhound before, but that sounds awesome. At full speed, it could be mistaken for a bolt of lightning. If two Rayhounds collide, <laughs> the sound is like a thunderclap. What? Uh, okay. That gives me the impression that we may have, um, potentially, a saddle to learn here. Oh, but we're like two levels away from it. I'm currently level 24. I've got one level to allocate. I'm going to chuck this one into... I don't even know where to put them anymore. I'm thinking we should put more levels into work speed. I'm actually... Oh, I don't know. Maybe attack? That only gives us... Two, yeah, let's just do attack for the time being. Now, does that get me to level 25? Or is that 24 that we're... Yeah, it's 24 that we're at. Well, the good news is we can learn the fluffy pal bed. And with a few nails, which we can gather once the metal helm here is crafted up, we can, uh, we can get some of those. And we can actually advance our base. So let's do that. The metal home has been acquired. Nice. And uh, let's just get like 10 nails. We're going to need them sooner or later anyways. So my metal helmet has now replaced my feathered headband. Gives us a ton more. Oh my goodness. 50 defense and 100 health. This thing was 15 <laughs> defense. Get rid of the little feather. Uh, yeah. Okay, cool. I'm glad that that is dealt with. Uh, oh, dude. And then after we get these nails, I think I'm also going to get my metal armor finally as well. And that is going to keep us going. I've been dying too quickly. We've been like too killable lately. So we can finally sort this out. And we might actually be able to survive longer than five minutes out there. All right. That is 10 nails acquired. Now that we've got that, let's get these fluffy beds. This is going to allow us to add two more pals to our squad out here as well, which is... You know, ideally what we're going for. I'm just going to check these things out here. 
<gasps> I need cloth as well. Oh, go team. Good job, guys. Good job. And let's get that second one placed down as well. It's nearly nighttime, so... You know what? Oh, I was going to jump in with the team and, like, help them out. But hopefully they come over here and help me out anyways. 15 seconds. We'll have our second bed done. We'll be done with this next evolution of our current base. And then all I got to do is bring two more powers into our squad. We can advance to the next level. And then fingers crossed one more level when we can, like, expand to a third base location. And that would be absolutely amazing. But it's nighttime. So before we do all of that, let's get a little rest in. And then fingers crossed. We get some good news here. So, uh, power box management. We got a lot more powers <laughs> that we haven't looked at recently. And it's something I probably should be keeping my eyes peeled for. Uh, because we need, like, the useful powers helping us out around here. Um, guys that can contribute to the team. Uh, or at least contribute to the, to the mission at hand. Um, I guess the most... Hmm... This guy cooks a lot better than our fox barks do. You know what? Yeah, let's bring you into the team. I could have just done both, but one will do. In fact, I've only got... I don't have any forges out here anymore, so these guys are kind of pointless to have here. Um, what we could probably do with maybe some more farmers. What does Joltik do? What does generate electricity? I don't have any electrical appliances out here, so it's probably pointless. Uh, watering, hands-on type of stuff. We're looking for... I guess... Actually, this guy's good. What could he replace? Yeah, this guy. Nox. Yeah, 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 yeah. Gale Claw. Come in here, my dude. Why not? Um, electricity. Yeah, once we need electricity, I guess that makes more sense. But ultimately... Um, uh, these guys are pretty all-terrain vehicles. Who could Flambelle replace? I need, like, guys that can carry a ton of stuff around and all that. You know what? I don't need to replace anything. Just just bring him in and it'll sort itself out. Mine some rocks for me, fuddler. All right. We're well, just like that. We've got 12 guys deployed out here now. So let's go and upgrade this base. Yeah, unfortunately. Oh, power generator. Yo, all right. Okay. And build a sphere assembly line. Oh, okay. We're, we're getting to like automation here. Okay. That's actually pretty sweet. Okay. That's really, really exciting as a matter of fact. All right. Let's get some eggs on the way. And, all right, let me have a look. What level do we need to craft this stuff? Because that sounds really, really interesting. Flower beds, antique mirror sets. What if we got so much stuff that we've learned here? Um, but, mounted crossbow power generator. I need two more levels to get my hands on that. We can also get our hands on the Rayhound saddle at that point. There's a hypersphere coming up, and the assembly line is three levels away. Well, if that's the case, maybe it is in my best interest to start turning my attention to some more boss fights. And I think that that is kind of what I'm going to be doing. Today, I think it's time for us to go fight some more bosses. But not before I get my hands on some metal armor. And my metal spear, of course, as well. At last. Also, a grapple gun. Because I think it's about... Wait. Wait, do I need a grapple gun? No. Let's skip the grapple gun. And we can actually go straight for the mega grapple gun once we get some more of these ancient parts. Oh yeah, I think that's that's probably the right call. And there is the metal armor acquired. This stuff has 70 defense, 250 health, uh, compared to... Eh, it's a bit of an improvement. Nothing crazy, but, but good nonetheless. We'll get rid of the old stuff and... Yeah, I look pretty badass now, don't I? Fantastic. Um, there was something else that I thought we needed before we go on any further i think it was was it the glider yeah because we finally got bones on us too we just need 20 cloth to make that happen so once we get these 20 cloth we can get the glider which means we can finally glide around the map which will be an absolute relief on top of that i'm gonna go on incubate another egg because i should really just keep an egg incubating at all times it's a smart choice to be doing and then i guess what we probably should turn our attention to is working out what sort of team we should have going into this fight. From experience, Surfin is an absolute beast. And I think we should definitely bring some of these with us. I'm actually going to organize these guys by level. So that's going to be... L Wait, yeah. Okay, high to low. There we go. Pengullet's a beast. But then so is the little 
so is this little dude with his little burly body so i'm wondering if he's probably a better choice these deers are cool and all but at the same time they're kind of they're good for travel but outside of that not a whole lot dinosum never really checked out but this guy's a good worker so you're probably best off actually chilling at home i think that's probably a good choice to be honest Fox Barks is pretty defensive and we can use him as a flamethrower. So that's actually a good option. Toka Toko, 100%. I need this guy's big old explodey eggs for certain. The question is though, do we bring two deers with us? Or do we bring someone like a Dire Howl with us? Or a Lee's Punk with us? These guys are pretty cool too. He's got no passive abilities, but he's got some pretty sweet dark attacks, I suppose. And then we got Daydream. I keep forgetting about this guy. We got Wooly Pop. I don't even know where this one he came from, but he's a dragon killer. I don't know if I'm planning to fight a dragon today. You know what? I think this team might suffice. Nah, let's bring t Fant instead. All right, this is the, the squad. But before we do go, I just want to make sure that all my guys are equipped with, I guess, the, the saddles or the, the things that we need to use their abilities. Pengullet. That's the only one I'm missing. Oh, is it time? Is it finally time we get the Pengullet rocket launcher? I think it might be. Uh, I just need to find it. There it is. Can I afford it? I'm two ingots short. Well, we can fix that, can't we? I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I think it's just, I think we just got to do it. I think it just makes so much darn sense to do 22 ingots, 20 ingots. Oh my goodness. It's the best. Oh, I love this. This outpost is just majestic and we can, all right, that's it. <laughs> Our guys have uh, seemed to have stopped working so much wood lying around. They're just chopping down trees all over the shop. It's nuts. Um, it's probably, maybe I should tell them to stop chopping down trees or something, but it is what it is. All right, on that note, let's get us the Pengullet rocket launcher. Unfortunately, it leads to the death of the poor penguin. It gets incapacitated and then we gotta, <laughs> we're gonna heal him up a little bit, but um, I think it'll go a long way. Mega glider also coming right up. And once these two things are ready, time to hit some buses. Mega glider. How's this thing? Hey, there we go. We can finally do it. <laughs> oh my goodness. It's been a long time coming. I don't know why it took so long to finally make that happen, but here we are nonetheless. Here we are nonetheless. All right, let's get that rocket launcher. Come on, buddy. Let's go. Let's get it done. Hey, I was right the other day. I didn't even realize uh, we can actually take our capture power up by one. We've got enough lift monk energy. And uh, yeah, I'm going to keep on continuing this stuff because I want that extra power. Uh, as far as enhancing our pets goes, I haven't done this in such a long time. I know we've got so many of these souls to actually make it happen. And it's probably worth doing before heading into this like next fight. I just, I, I worry about wasting them, I guess. I don't really know how it works and stuff, but like, yeah, I got to work out exactly what it's worth wasting these on or using them on. I don't know yet. It just makes me nervous using them too soon. And on that note, we've finally got Pangala's rocket launch. Oh my goodness, I've been wanting this since like day one. All right, it's time for us to go. Let's do this thing. We're going to fast travel. And you know what? Let's start out with Pen King. <laughs> it's, I think it's like the lowest level boss that we currently qualify for, or at least uh, have located. And I think that it is just up atop this tower. Or this, this staircase, sorry. Um, is it up here? Hold on, let me just run. Let me just run with my guy. What are we doing here? Yeah, here it is. All right. I haven't entered one of these sealed realms before. So this is a first. Well, let's do it. Enter the dungeon. Oh, snap. All right. Yeah. It's like a boss. Is this... Oh, okay. All oh, right. All right. I forgot. I forgot we're going to have like multiple bosses as well. Okay. Uh, not ideal. We got three of them to take down. All right. Yeah, I completely forgot that that was going to be a thing. Oh, snap. Okay. 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 I also forgot that pink kings are kind of like forced to reckon with. I'm stuck. Oh, snap. Okay. All right. You know what? Toko, Toko, Toko. Let's go, mate. Oh, gosh. I'm frozen. I'm dying. I'm dead. I'm going to die. I'm going to die out here. All right. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here, explode everything. Let's go. Blow it to pieces. Blow it to smithereens. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. This is not good. This is not good. Take him down. Take him. No! Oh! <laughs> I really gotta fix that setting. 
This world is so broken with the three times boss difficulty modifier, whatever you want to call it. What a mistake that was. Um, Toka Toko though, absolute beast out there. Uh, all right, our, our, dear, our poor deer died though. Everyone else is all good. I'm smashed to smithereens. Uh, dang it, that really didn't go according to plan. I was thinking earlier today it might be time for us to undo that setting. I think I'm going to go and undo that setting right now. All right, we're back. Except I didn't completely wipe things out, and I'll explain why. So our original setting was three, which means basically for every one pal that wants to spawn in this world, there's generally three of them, which has led to us dying a lot lately. Well, instead of changing it just to a flat one, what I've done is changed it to 1.5. And my thought process there is that now there's kind of like a chance that it's either going to be one or two. So there's still going to be like a little bit of an excitement factor or just random factor. Um, depending on like, I don't know, as we enter arenas and bosses and stuff like that, there is a chance we're going to get one or two. And I feel like that's just a cool idea. Um, and already I can feel the difference here. These guys here are just pains in the butt still, though. But get absolutely annihilated. Let's go. <laughs> it's a lot easier to take one of these down than two. That's for certain. All right, let's go. Let's do this thing. Let's see what this new crossbow of ours can do. And just like that, Pen King. You know what? I'm going to try and... No, I was going to try and catch him. Doesn't matter, though. We got us some ancient technology points. And uh, just like that, it's dead. <laughs> That was so that was so easy. <laughs> Once you like remove the stupidity factor from it all. Yeah, get wrecked. Unfortunately though, Toko Toko died because tanking exploded. But uh it is what it is. I kind of Oh, I can't fight it again for another hour. Alright. Uh in hindsight, I might have made an a, an error. <gasps> Toko Toko now needs to recover. He got absolutely smacked to pieces. Which means I can't use him in our next fight. So we're going to have to find a new way of doing things. Um, and who is the next fight going to be? Uh, Azurobi out here? Or should we take on King Packer? I've never fought King Packer before. Sounds kind of cool though. Um, all right, let's teleport to the small settlement. I'm a little nervous about doing this and I'll explain why. Uh, last time I was here, I accidentally shot this guy and he shot back. And it got a little bit out of, out of hand. But it looks like he's forgiven us because he ain't firing at us on site. So that's nice. Um, but I do need to get up to this bridge. And I'm kind of hoping we can fast track it. Yeah, looking good. I can hear fire music. Though. I don't know who's fighting. Oh, no, he's still... Wait, no, Syndicate Thugs. <gasps> oh, okay, that's okay then. I thought... I thought that the, the level 30 security guard was on us again, but thankfully not. All right, let's cross this bridge. Got to avoid the camp. Oh, there's my base. Oh, wow. Why didn't we just come to my... Would have been a lot simpler to just come to my base, I think. Um, oh, gosh, I wasn't planning to fight these guys. Uh, don't mind me. Sorry, little pal that I could have saved, but have decided not to. I'm, uh, I'm just passing by. Woo! Lift Monk Effigy, let's go! Gotcha. Alright, where's this boss fight? Must be down here. Is this it? I've set like a little waypoint. Ah, oh, there he is. Now, we've got one or two of them out here. Just one by the looks of it. And this one here is just out here in the wild. He's not accompanied by anything. These Mel Packers, I still haven't caught one of these, by the way. Maybe I should. Um, maybe I should. Can I just straight up do that? 50%. I mean, it's a low level. And I tick it off on my little, you know, catch box thing in my bobby. Please don't fight me. Oh, big, big, big. All right, he's all right, all right. I mean, I should have known. All right, okay, let's go. You want some of this? Um, get wrecked. <laughs> oh, big fella. All right, then. All right, then, mate. Let's go. Stone cannon. Get wrecked by my big stone. I missed him. I missed him. All right. Stone blast then. You know what? I'm going to mix things up a little bit. Let's let's switch things up. Um, who are we going to use? Let's switch it to... Oh, Serpent is the guy. 
Hundred percent. Come here. Come here. Come on, Stefan. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. There we go. Aqua guns. Uh, hydro jets. Or we'll see. I don't even know what we're doing here. Where are my abilities? Uh, these aren't as strong as I was hoping. Serpent might maybe isn't the right <laughs> choice for this fight. Yeah, this guy definitely seems to be uh, immune of some sort. All right, fine, fine, fine. I'm trying to dismount here. Let's yeah. go, Pengullet. It's time to use the cannon. It's time to use the Pengullet cannon. Let's go. <laughs> oh, I don't need to do 300 damage. And Pengullet's dead. Okay, that really didn't work out as I had planned or hoped. Um, okay, okay. Uh, okay, we're going to be careful here. Yeah, we do. Because this guy uh, kind of doesn't mess around. Hide behind the tree. Oh, okay, we took minimal da damage there, but we are kind of weakened. All right, t -Fent, let's go, mate. All right, let's go. Help me, help me out. Something tells me your water abilities aren't going to help us a whole lot. But keep it, keep it up, keep it up. Actually, wait, no, don't get body slams. I should be using you for heals. Heal me, heal me, heal me, heal me. Help me, help me, help me. I'm very low on health. No. Oh, okay, go on. Keep it going. Keep it going. All right, no more. There's no more. There's no more in him. Um, yeah, we're kind of really low on abilities now all of a sudden. I do not feel very optimistic about this fight all of a sudden. But if we could get some good headshots off, we might... If I could actually hit the target, that is, we might be able to make it happen. All right, let's switch it up. We're going back to big old deary dude. All right, if I can hit this thing with a stone blast, it might it might work. That doesn't look like a nice ability. We're good. All right, you know what? Charge, charge. Forty damage, not enough, mate. Not enough. Stone blast. Let's go. Um, antler bomb. Let's go. <laughs> Just drop everything you got, mate. Get him. Yeah, fifty damage. All right. Well, in good news, we got him halfway down. That's that's positive. That is a positive. I'm going to go get my uh, T-Fan back out here again. My little elephant dude. At least then I might be able to get some heals soon. But oh, I got Rush Roar. Let's just enter the fight as well. Stop. It's nighttime again already. Oh gosh, I'm really low on health. I've just realized too. Um, okay. No, no, no. I don't know why I'm drawing his attention. I'm so low on health. I just got to let my dude like do his thing. Got him low. He's down to like a third health. I think I'm just going to let them go at it for it. Wow, that was a big bomb. Hey, over here. Not on my watch, mate. Not on my watch. Ouch. Took my shield down again. Fair enough. Defense getting absolutely annihilated out there too. He's down to 400 health though. Come on. Like, like, like. <laughs> That's too close, man. There's another 50 damage. We're good. We're good. Bit of a duck and a weave and a dodge and a dive. But we've done it. We've done it. Get ranked big. Oh, I should have tried to catch him. I think you can catch these guys. What was I thinking? All right. I probably wasn't thinking. Let's be honest with ourselves here. But in good news, it's conquered. And that's what we came to do. I uh, just got to work out now how to get back home. In case you guys don't know, by the way, when I complain about it being dark, it is a lot darker for me than you guys. I actually apply like a bit of a lightning filter so you guys can see what is going on. Um, I, on the other hand, cannot see a thing. Uh, it's, it's, it's quite rough. I just jumped into a big old canyon. That is less than ideal, but I kind of got a little sidetracked by this little guy over here. Come to me. Another effigy, nice. All right, let's head back home. And thankfully, we have done so successfully. All right, everybody, let's get some rest. I ain't done. I ain't ready to lay down just yet. I feel like we've got one more boss fight in us. The downside is uh, all my guys are pretty. Oh, they're all healed. Oh, sleeping heals them? Oh, I didn't know that. Oh, that's, that's fantastic. Uh, beautiful, beautiful. All right. It doesn't look like we've pulled any, like, major loot here, unfortunately. It's all just pretty stock standard stuff. Uh, we got some pancake. We got feathers. I guess that's kind of cool. We got some more bones. That's always that's always welcome. Oh, hold on a second. We got another egg. Completely forgot about this. And it is a celery. We got one of those. 
We caught one the other day and then we got attacked by like a bunch of stuff, didn't we? Um, this team is good, but it's very water heavy, isn't it? We definitely need some more variety in here. Uh, the die howl, supposedly pretty good. We're getting attacked by something or is we, 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 we're cool. We're cool. All right. Let's have a look at what we've got out here. We're still not ready for Mamorous, who's like just outside of our base. But I think we might be good to take on Azurobe out here. Maybe I'll even try and catch it. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. I don't even know if you can catch these boss things. But from what I understand, everything is kind of catchable in this game. Yeah. Even the people. It made, it's crazy, but supposedly it's true. All right. So we're heading out here into the middle of the ocean. Ah, uh, this fight might... I might be best off using somebody else for this one. But we will... There it is. There it is. The Lady of the Lake. Oh, it's a beautiful thing too, isn't it? All right. Should we, just, should we just go at it? Should we just do this thing and see how it goes? All right. Let's initiate this fight. Actually, before I do, um, I do want to see... I'm gonna toggle. I've, I, I haven't really done it yet, but you press the number two to like toggle your spheres. I've never really used. Wow, I just bounced straight off of the thing. I've never used any of like the special spheres. I feel like maybe I should probably start doing that. But, anyways, uh, ouch, that kind of hurt. Yeah, okay, okay, I get it. I get it. You're tougher than me. I get it. You're tougher than me. Uh, Pengolet, you want to help me out, dude? Let's go. Uh, wrong button. Wrong button. Let's go. <laughs> I'm gonna fire a rocket straight at this thing. Let's go. Come here. Get in there, Pangolet. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. And kapow. <laughs> 500 damage. Much better that time. There we go. All right, you know what? I think I'm just going to work this down myself. This doesn't seem like too tough of a fight. I can keep hitting it with headshots and just dodging its attacks, which I'm str kind of struggling to do. We might be all right here. There's going to be toughies to dodge because they're... Homing. Oh, I'm way too close. I'm way too close. Yeah, I don't think we would have survived nothing if we didn't upgrade our armor today. But thankfully we did. All right, we're going to get it as low as we could possibly get it. And then I'm going to sphere this thing. Like four more hits, maybe. One. Ouch. Missed it. Oh, you little wiggled your head. Okay, 310 health remains. 225. I can hit it at least two more, three more times, maybe. Yeah, I'm gonna get for body shots now. All right. One more body shot. It's gonna be very low. There we go. And now, Spirit. 15% chance. That's decent. That's decent. Oh, <laughs> we did it. We did it. And that counts as a kill, too. Nice. All right. Okay, I got some stuff out of that. Uh, precious dragon stones can be sold to a merchant for a high price. Okay, I'm holding on to those. Uh, dude, the only thing is, I haven't looked at my power deck in such a long time. Um, where was it? Is it this guy here? As a robe. It was brittle. I don't know if you saw that. Good at watering, a level three. I don't have any level three waterers yet. Um, brittle, though, is what its ability is. And that sounds kind of weak, so I don't know what... I don't actually know what that means. Um, but kind of concerning, I guess? Have we got it in us to do one more of these things? Because we might. All right, let's go for one more. The final boss battle of the day. And I actually don't know where it is. It's, it's beneath me. All right, this way. Is this going to be a fly? Oh, it's up here. There's literally like an arena for it. Is this it? Yeah, oh, it's another one of these ones. All right, well, in good news, if there is any good news, Toko Toko has not used his big old... Okay, that is not what I was expecting. Um, But, yeah. come here, my dude. It's time. Let's drop some bombs. Let's do this thing. Catch... Oh, didn't do much damage. I think he's pretty immune. Not immune, but, like, it's not dealing... A... Oh, snap, he just tell... It's like a ninja. It's just like a samurai. Ninja? I don't know what you call this. But very immune to explosive damage by the looks of it. Which is... Oh! That wasn't very nice. Okay. 
bit of some leafy blade attacks then possibly all right last bomb oh okay okay we gotta be careful that really hurt okay come back here come back here all right um yep yeah, his attacks phase through pillars good to know oh snap okay okay we're gonna die we're gonna die uh please don't please don't please don't no 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 oh i got like no health left uh uh, uh please 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 show me show me show me heal me heal me heals where are my heals heal me <laughs> okay good 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 ouch not not doing good enough we're not doing good enough here he's about to teleport again yep there it goes oh, that sucks so bad all right there's a quick one to get back to at least we gotta have one more attempt at that all right we've got our stuff back however my guys didn't get healed or at least pengala didn't he's still incapacitated maybe it's because he died or something i don't know um how about you though are you able to launch bombs possibly let's have a look fingers crossed hey eh? <laughs> i guess um okay are you ready for bomb yes yes he just recharged he just recharged all right not that it really helped us a whole lot in that last attempt but it's still good to know 100 damage is pretty good regardless he's right on top of me he's right on top of me he's right on top of me all right we gotta fire these things a little bit less frequently really not as effective well like not as effective but it's it's hit and miss hit and miss all right let's go about to teleport onto me oh my guy good okay we're gonna use our guys as kind of like divergence then i guess and hopefully when he does his little sword slash attack he targets my guy instead but he seems yeah he's coming for me ouch help me out buddy help me out serpent let's go let's go let's go get over here all right let's hit him nice work Where's my bubble bubble blasters? Let's go. Bubbles, 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 bubbles for days. Yes. Aqua jet. Yeah. Another one of these bombs. Aqua jet again. I got no, I got no abilities. All right. I don't even know what we're doing here. He's about to do his thing. No. Okay. All right. He's low. He's low. That's the main thing. We're doing okay. I'm going to try and catch this thing. I think we just have to. It just seems like the way to go. And we need some stronger friends. Okay, uh, we are getting kind of messed up here right now. All right, all right, right. Retreat, retreat, retreat. All right. Oh, okay. Fire blast. Cool. Just don't do your little charge attack. That'll really suck if you decide to do that right now. All right, headshot. Headshot ish. That's a headshot. That's a headshot. I'm going for the catch. Let's go. 5%. All right. We're going to have to use a better sphere. Let's use our very first mega sphere. 17% is not going to be enough. Let's go again. 17. Not going to be enough. Oh, dude. We're wasting all our mega spheres. Come on. Just give me that one little wriggle. That's all I want. All right. We're going to go giga sphere if that's the case. Giga sphere. Oh, 40%. Much better. Come on. Come on. No. So close. 40. Come on. That's good. That's all the way. There we go. Bushy is a dainty eater. <laughs> all right. Let's get back home. We have done it. Now that was our boss gauntlet. But I'm going to see what we actually caught there because that's kind of the most important things. We got two bosses. Our Azurobi is brittle. <laughs> Terrible defense. So pretty much not good for traveling, but good for watering. So I might stick her at the base. Uh, and then we got Bushy, who is, um, okay, probably a very good worker. Level three lumbering, level two transporting, level one handiwork, two kindling, one gathering. Dude, this thing's a beast. Oh my goodness. Just load your base with these guys and you are set. Um, and like satiety, say it, say it, uh, drops 10% loss. So can just work and work and work fire attack ice attack water attack pretty much one of all the elements uh this thing is a beast like a real beast yeah 100 you need to join the team who are you going to replace though becomes the question who's like the most useless guy i've got here i don't know but 
Dude, yeah, yeah. Get in there, mate. Help us out. You're an absolute legend. Get onto it. Well, look, in good news, we got an extra level. So we, we, got, we got a little bit closer to what we're aiming for. Uh, we still want another level or two before we're able to get what we need. <gasps> we can learn the mega grappling gun now, though. That's pretty handy. And I think we might even get the average feed bag, too. Um, but yeah, there we go. We've unlocked Azurobi saddle. Hey, that's good timing. Uh, and heat resistant metal armor. If that's something I want to get my hands on. But we're still one level away from the power generator, uh, which we're probably pretty close to now. So, yeah, the boss killing did exactly what I wanted the boss killing to do. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll catch you in the next one very, very soon. But until then, keep on smiling. Have a fantastic day. Bye for now.